Well, welcome to part three of our raising chicken video. Today is moving day. The girls graduated from the pullet pen and we're gonna transfer them in the transfer cage from the pullet grow pen over to the chicken um, coop out there in the chicken yard. And uh, it's a big, a big deal for them and us. So we'll be right back after the break. <laughs> This video is number three, transferring from the grow pen to the chicken yard, Raising Chickens 101, A Beginner's Guide to Chickens. Here's our first volunteer. Well, we got all the chickens transferred from the pullet pen over here to the chicken coop. And uh, what we'll do is we'll keep them in here for two, at least two weeks, most likely three. I'll keep the door shut so they can't go out and they get used to this coop in here and, real, and learn to realize that this is home and this is safety. So after about two or three weeks, we'll open the door over there and let them venture out into the yard. So... Um, <laughs> Until then, they're going to be uh, in their new home, getting used to things. They seem to like this straw uh, compared to the, um, uh, the uh, uh, fine um, pine shreddings. They, they're playing around and having a good old time up in there with it. So we're just going to let them enjoy themselves for a couple hours. I'm going to bring them out some watermelon in a little while. Just let them get calmed down from the move. I know they're stressed out from it. And, um, We'll be back here in, uh, in a couple of two or three weeks and we'll watch them when they go outside for the first time. So until then, we'll see you in a couple of weeks. Mm -hmm. Well, good morning, ladies. Well, today's graduation days for the girls. They've been in the, uh, inside the coop for two weeks now, so they're pretty accustomed to this is now home, and they, I think they recognize that. And today I'm gonna open the door and let them um, venture out into the chicken yard. Uh, they'll be timid at first, I'm sure, so I'll probably have to take a couple of these old crusty old roosters here, and I'll take one outside, and then I'll take one and shove him through the door to show them that's how to get in and out. And uh, I think after a few minutes, the other ones will follow suit. They just got to um, get up the nerve to get out there and quit being chickens. So you can, you look like a good volunteer to go outside. But anyway, let's, uh, let's get the uh, door open and let's see how they do. All right, and you be the first volunteer. You ready? Why don't you go right on out there? See, a little bit scared. She changed her. Oh, here he comes back. <laughs> you didn't like it out there? All right, let's take a couple of them and outside, all the way outside. Okay, I'm gonna get him a little further away from the chicken door so he won't turn around and run back in. There you go. And check things out, buddy. Go ahead. <laughs> Piece of grass touched him.
Well, the girls are getting used to the new chicken yard. They're enjoying learning all about the outside and picking at things and eating grasshoppers and eating grasses. They're just enjoying themselves out here. So I guess they're not mad at me for um, moving them out of the pullet pen out here anymore. So I guess they forgave me. But anyway, we're off and running with the chickens. They're doing really well. Every day they get a little bit more used to their surroundings and um, learning more about how to, to live in their, in their brand new chicken yard. So uh, we've enjoyed this journey up till now. We're looking forward to the first egg. That should be here in about five more weeks. So we'll uh, come back on the next video and show you some egg collecting as soon as they start laying. So we thank you for joining us on this journey. And if you've enjoyed watching us bring these chickens to life around here, please uh, subscribe and be a part of our homestead family. We've got a lot of uh, new videos coming out and new interesting things that we're doing around the homestead that's it's getting close to um, really getting somewhere now. We're, we're really feeling like a real homestead now. So uh, we've enjoyed the journey. We're so thankful for God for giving us everything he's given us. And we're thankful for you for being a part of our family. So until me and Nancy and Bing Bing, see you next time. Always remember. By his hands, we are fed. Give us, Lord, our daily bread. Amen. Have a blessed day. Thank you for watching our videos. We love making them. If you like our videos, we ask you to partner with us in our mission by sharing our videos from YouTube and posts from Facebook to all social medias. It really inspires and encourages us. Some great places to share is Facebook, Twitter, Instagram. Please like if you like this video, subscribe, click the notification button so you never miss another video. Click below for products we used in the videos and you could also partner with us without spending a penny. We welcome your encouraging comments, prayers and questions. And thank you for watching and sharing our videos and posts. Have a blessed day.